When you're working in Bridge, you're typically selecting items from favorites or folders, and then they open up the contents over here, one folder at a time. Some folders have a whole lot more in them than others. I like to be organized, so I wanna talk about stacks. Stacks are like a stack or a deck of cards. You can put a whole bunch of things together and then open and close the stack when you need it. For example, I've got some really nice photographs here of a fungus, but I've got three. I don't want them occupying three spaces. I start by clicking on this one. If I hold the Command key, that's Command on a Mac, Control and Windows, and I hold that one down, I can do non-contiguous selection. Anything I want, anywhere it is. If I hold the Shift key down, because they are all three in order, I start with this one, hold the Shift key, and click the last one, selects everything. Once I have them selected, there's a couple of ways I can go about this. Let's use the pull-down menu for now. If I go up to the word Stacks, the first item is Group a Stack. And notice the shortcut is the same one used by most programs for grouping. Command on a Mac, Control and Windows, G. If I select it, Instant Stack. The number three is telling me that there are three items inside the stack. If I click here and drag, I can go through and look at the images. If I click here, I can, in a sense, play them. Now, let's review something. If you're on a Windows system, go to Edit, on a Macintosh, Bridge, and go to Preferences and go into playback. When I click the button for playback, it was showing me X number of images per second. I can change that if I want to. Up to you. Let's go ahead and get back out of here. If I want to see all of them, very easy, select the group, hold down the Command key, Control and Windows Command on a Mac, and press the right arrow key, and it will expand them out. Left arrow key, we'll put them back in again. If you forget that, you can always go to the word Stacks, and it shows it to you here on expanding or collapsing. Incidentally, here is another place to change the frame rate if you want to. Let's go ahead and reopen them with the shortcut Command or Control right arrow. Let's say that I don't want one of them in the group anymore. Select it, drag it out. I changed my mind, I'm fickle. I want it back again. I can put it anywhere in the stack. If I select one of these and go back up to the word Stacks, one of the items is promote to the top of the stack. Now, if I do that, watch what happens. It puts it on the top. To what end? Well, another way to actually expand or collapse the stack is by clicking the number three right up there. That's now the top item. If you have a stack, it would be nice if the first item in the stack gave you an idea of what's inside of it. Stacks can help you organize large folders. If you don't want it anymore, you can click right here and select it, go back up to the word Stacks, and say Ungroup from Stack. And we're back to where we started. Stacks can really organize for you. Don't forget you got them.